Hello, my fish has arrived and I'm going to be unboxing it. Hello, my fish has arrived and now I'm just going to be unboxing it. Now I'm going to water temperature. Um, so this is my beta fish. You probably can't see it very well, but now I'm just going to float the back in for 20 minutes to equalise the water temperature. So now it is after three minutes, kind of settling in. It's not really moving that much, but I'm sure it's alive. It looks really good, and it's approximately one year old. Um, really can't see it but that's just how the blag's floating. This is how the first step you want to do to acclimate your fish is to the bag in water for 20 minutes and I'll show you what to do after that is done. Bye for now. Now we need to cut the bag and we need to add some of the water from the aquarium into the bag. So don't put it in the aquarium. Have you put it in the aquarium? I'll put the water in the bag into the aquarium.
Okay, so just a quick rundown of what you should have done. Firstly, you should have turned your aquarium light off. Secondly, you should have acclimated the fish to the temperature by floating the bag into the aquarium for 20 minutes, which I have. Thirdly, what you want to do is you need to add some of the water from the aquarium into the bag to make sure that the pH, the temperature, the nitrite, the nitrate and ammonia converge or adjust. So then you need to wait 10 minutes, which I am doing right now. Okay, so so far what you should have done is firstly you should have turned your aquarium light off. The fish can be stressed, so it's very important to turn your aquarium light off. Secondly, you should float the bag into the aquarium for 20 minutes to make sure that the temperatures are the same in the bag and the aquarium. After that, you want to add some of the water from your aquarium into your bag. This is to make sure that the temperature, the pH, the ammonia, the nitrite and nitrate are relatively the same from the bag and your aquarium. That's all you should have done by now. Um, after 10 minutes, I'll tell you what to do. Okay then, after you've waited 10 minutes, you want to add some more water until the bag reaches the top. You probably already know how to, so I'm not going to do it again. You can go back if you did not see it. But after that, it's 10 minutes that you've just waited. You need to add all the water until it's onto, until it's full of the bag. Of course, after you've waited the 10 minutes again, um, I'll show you what to do. It's been 10 minutes um, again. So now we're going to net the fish out, out of the bag and release it into my aquarium. Sorry, I couldn't capture me actually releasing into the aquarium, but I am going to show you what I did. I emptied the bag and the beta fish into this bowl or mug, two meters. I got the net, I scooped the beta out, and I put it into my tank. I did not empty any of the water from the bag into the aquarium, as this will mean, because this will mean that the beta fish has already acclimated but if I add the new water then it will be a shock to my already pre-existing beneficial bacteria into my tank and that water may have higher ammonia than my tank so I really don't want to do that so I just netted it out and put it into my aquarium and now I'm just going to show you what it looks like. It's just bound to hide behind the plant. Um, now do not turn on the light for another four hours because the beta needs time to adjust to your tank. Bye, thank you.